So this is from my last project. It's my scissor lift. And what I've done is added some gears to it. And I'll show you how it works. So I put some tools on there to show you that it can lift. So I have three dogs and they want to come on the couch but they can't jump anymore. And I have some stairs but they won't go up the stairs. So I tried to lift them on the couch but then they ran away. So I thought why not try a dog elevator. And that's why I came up with this idea. Now the first thing I'm going to do is make some gears. Now all the pins are dried and I will try it out. That works. This piece will be for the side for the lift. I have to cut a slot in it so what I'm going to do is push it through the saw till this point and then cl um, clean the rest up with the bandsaw. Now I can put on one of the gears and tighten it on here. So I drilled it so it's nice and snug. And I'll put a nut on this end here. And just tighten it up. Now I'm going to cut two pieces and these will be for the guides. Now these guides can just be screwed on to the side piece here. This piece will be for the slide for the threaded rod and I need two of them. Now this piece can go on here and I cut a small piece of threaded rod and I'll just put the gear in here and tighten it with a nut. 
These two pieces can be screwed onto the back now. So just a few more small adjustments. So the threaded rod goes through the slide into the holes and I use the, a couple of nuts to, to make the adjustment for the right height. To hold the side piece I'll just put on some brackets. Now I can put the side on. Now I just have to screw that on the bottom.